Today I am in Chartres, a city famous for its stunning cathedral. At night, during the warmer months, the magnificent buildings of the town come to life with an outstanding light show. At the central covered market, I am enthused by the atmosphere where the best food of the region is on display. It is in this region around Chartres that some of the best wheat in France is grown. And good wheat means good bread. And the bread in this region is fabulous. I am inspired by the freshness of the greens. I could live in this place. Goat cheese is the most popular specialty of the region. They are made by small farmers in all kinds of shapes and textures. This delicious entree of warm goat cheese salad is really popular in French bistros. First, in a bowl, I place a little Dijon mustard, some red wine vinegar, a little salt and pepper, and combine well before whisking in some walnut oil. In a larger bowl, I place some salad green, cherry tomato halves, and some walnut halves. I very gently toss the dressing with these ingredients. Next, I cut six slices of goat cheese, about one centimeter thick. Ask your cheesemonger for a ripe, flavorsome goat cheese. I rub six toasted slices of baguette with a little garlic and top with a slice of goat cheese. Place on the hot grill to warm and melt the cheese a little. I carefully spoon the salad on plates and place the cheese slices on top of the salad. This superb salad de chèvre au noix is a treat. The classy Grand Monarch Hotel in Chartres has been the home of the excellent Le Georges restaurant for over 50 years. The food is modern and elegant. My delicate dish of local white asparagus was superbly presented and perfectly cooked. At the end of my meal, I was thrilled to witness the cooking of my dessert, a light Grand Marnier Soufflé, one of the most festive French desserts that never goes out of fashion. At La Cour du Monarque, the second and more casual restaurant of the hotel, I was encouraged to try the Pâté de Chartres the restaurant's classic signature specialty. The chef, Benoit Cello, was kind enough to invite me into his kitchen to witness the preparation of this special pie. Alors, le pâté de Chartres, c'est un pâté en croûte qui est fait avec une farce à base de, de canard, de veau et de porc. The charcuterie is shaped in a special mold lined with a battery pastry. A mixture of chopped mixed meat is then placed at the base of the pie. A large piece of foie gras, a duck liver pâté, is pushed in the center and covered with small mixed meat. The pie is then covered with pastry and carefully sealed, and the chef constructs a chimney to allow the steam to escape during the cooking. It is truly a noble French dish and it's so delicious. Tomorrow I am in the great city of Amiens in Picardy to taste the local specialties.